whether it's veg beds or flower beds, it's great if you've got lots of space. But then there's always that awful problem of access. You know, people tell you to have nice narrow beds so you can get onto them and reach your crops or do your deadheading or maybe add something new to your flower bed. But most of us have got wider beds than that. And the idea of putting down a path just really doesn't appeal because you don't want to lose your growing space to a whole lot of bits of paving. But what you need then instead is this. It's the easy part. It unrolls almost like a sort of concertina, comes toggled together so it's easy to store. But the great thing is when you've got it in place, you then use these toggles to attach it to the ground. Why would you want to put this on the ground? Well, it's really sturdily made. Inside here is a, a kind of grid which gives it strength and it gives it, well, it stops it curling when it, say, gets hot or whatever it might be. It's then covered in woven polyethylene and that gives it really good strength and a good degree of water resistance as well. So you lay it down and then using the galvanised pegs, and of course, because they're galvanised, they're not going to rust at all easily you can then put a path like this down somewhere like in the middle of this bed you can get to your sweet peas without squashing all your plants in the way or without getting yourself covered in mud now it's up to you you could carry one of these around with you in your garden put it down as and when you needed it and then move it on or you can leave it here for the whole season and from the end of the season you simply lift it up again pop the pegs into something i don't know i use something like an old jam jar you know where they are for the next year. Roll this up when it's dried up again and then hang it in your shed or your garage or pop it under the stairs, any sort of storage space you've got. But meanwhile, it's instant access without any long-term damage. Easy Path, another better design from Hacksnicks.